Recently, when I was downloading Windows 10 ISO file, I accidentally clicked this uh, double click button and you can just imagine what has happened. I have downloaded like 5 gigs of ISO files hundreds of times and it's much later in the point that I realized ISOs are consuming that much amount of space. I have been using my laptop since 3 years. Well, finally my laptop is completely full. The reason is pretty simple. I have downloaded a bunch of duplicate files. Usually it happens on accident. Especially this can be really difficult if you got lots of different file types in a single folder. You know, I can delete them one by one in manual way, but that can be a really tedious task. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how you can free up your PC storage in a very easy steps by removing duplicate files. So without further ado, let's get started. So being a YouTuber, I have to deal with lots of video files on a daily basis. Occasionally, I do tend to copy files in a same directory, creating many of the duplicate files. And the thing is, I can't able to delete all those files manually since it will take lot of time and mainly I don't know whether I have the main copy of that file or not. As a result, my folder structure may look like this, which have a bunch of duplicate files consisting of photos, videos, and multiple of other file types as well. Surely manually deleting all those is not the option because if you go into any folder, you can see there are bunch of duplications and it's not just in a single folder, it's in the multiple folders that these files are existing. Windows should have provided some solution to delete these duplicate files. In search of trustworthy solution, I stumbled upon PassFab duplicate file deleter. And by trustworthy, I mean this software can easily able to recognize similar images based on their appearance. Other softwares may just look at the size and file name and all that, but this tiny little difference makes your job much more easier. Usually, filled up storage is cause of all these issues, but don't worry, you can deal with this problem much more easily. With the PassFab duplicate deleter, you can remove your duplicate photos, videos, documents and other file formats as well. And whether it's onto your PC, laptop, SD card or maybe onto any external storage. And removing duplicate is very simple, just 3 steps, add scanning folders, set scanning mode and remove all the duplicates. To install it, just go onto the link given in the description and takes couple of seconds to install it. Once you open it up, you'll get this window. Now you can add a folder right over here. Now here I'm going to choose my parent folder where the repetitions of the files are occurring. Now from here on you can scan the duplicates but there is a setting cog right over here. Here you can set the ignore parameters also duplicate files parameters. In the general settings you can set the maximum file size. Also here is an option to move to recycle bin. So it will make sure that this file deleter will not automatically delete your files without your permission. And you will always have chance to recover them from your recycle bin. Into the ignore scan tab. I have seen many duplicate file deleters and they don't provide this ignore option and accidentally deleting system file can break your system entirely. Here you can ignore all those things. Also in the duplicate file options, you can match the content by their content or just by the file name. Additionally, you can also select the file types as well. Let's say your folder got important documents. So you can simply uncheck your document option and ignore all the duplicate deletions right there. Okay, so without wasting any time, let's scan our duplicates by clicking onto this blue button and just check out the speed of the scanning. Here you can see, once I click on it, it's super fast. In just like a five seconds, it has completed the scanning and presented us with the, all the duplicate files. Even more handy, it shows you all the quantities of each individual file. Also onto the left corner, you can quickly glance how much are video files, audios or maybe images files. And here if you click onto any file, you can see all the copies of it and decide what to do with all those. So you can select all the files that you don't need and then click on remove and click on yes and all of your selected files will be deleted. Obviously, if you got lots of reputation, also there is an option to auto select all of these files. So yeah, you can definitely select that one. Now from here, they will go into the recycle bin and you have a second chance to recover all of your files back again. So for sure, you will not miss any of important file. And sure enough, checking back the folder, I can clearly see all the repeated files are gone and I only have a single copy of each of the file. 
Now here you might be seeing two of the similar images right over here. To deal with similar looking image files, you have another option in PassFab duplicate file deleter. With the scan similar images, we can remove all such duplicates like this. So here you can see all of the similar images are detected and now I can choose to decide what to keep and what to delete. And sure enough, it works all the time. You can see this is before and after deleting all the files, here is my clean directory, you can take a look at it. To really test the limits of the software, I even tried rotating bunch of images and it did detect all those images as the same looking images and since it is not permanently deleted yet, I can easily restore any of the item from here. In my opinion, PassFab duplicate file deleter is 100% safe and it does not invade your privacy. So guys, that's all for today's video. I hope this video was helpful. If that is the case, make sure to hit that like, share this video, subscribe to our channel and this is Kedar from How to Guys signing out.